TrueBlot is Rockland's premier product line designed to produce publication quality western blots from immunoprecipitation protocols. In this video, we will briefly show you how to use TrueBlot from start to finish. Produce the pre-cleared lysate. Add 2 micrograms of primary antibody and 50 microliters of pre-equilibriated TrueBlot IP bead slurry to cold pre-cleared cell lysate. Incubate at 4 degrees Celsius for one hour or overnight for best results on a rocking platform or a rotator. Centrifuge the tube at 2500 G for 30 seconds at 4 degrees Celsius. Discard supernatant and wash the Trueblot IP beads 3 to 5 times with 500 microliters of cold lysis buffer. Centrifuge the tube at 2500 G for 30 seconds at 4 degrees Celsius between each wash. Discard the supernatant after each wash. After the last wash, add 50 microliters of 1x reducing SDS page sample loading buffer with beta mercaptoethanol, dithiothreatol, or equivalent reducing agent to pellet. Vortex and heat to 90 to 100 degrees Celsius for 10 minutes. Centrifuge at 10,000 G for 5 minutes. Collect supernatant and load onto the gel. Perform SDS page according to the protocols specified by the equipment's manufacturer. Prepare the SDS gel and transfer membranes for the transfer process. Place the membrane into the blocking buffer, enough to cover the membrane, and incubate for two hours at room temperature on a rocking platform. Remove the blocking buffer and rinse flat with TBS tween. Prepare the primary mouse immunoblotting antibody and blocking buffer at 1 microgram per milliliter. We recommend Rockland's Blockout Universal Blocking Buffer. Incubate the blot with the primary antibody overnight at 4 degrees Celsius on a rocking platform. Wash the blot at least 3 to 5 times in TBS tween. Each wash for a minimum of 5 to 10 minutes each. Total should be more than 1 hour. Prepare the True Blood Anti IgG at the recommended dilution in the blocking buffer.
Incubate the blot with the secondary antibody for one hour at room temperature on a rocking platform. Wash the blot at least three to five times in TBS tween. Each wash for at least five minutes each. Total should be more than one hour. Develop the blot using a chemiluminescent HRP substrate. We recommend Rockland Femtomax. Image the membrane with equipment designed for chemiluminescent detection. TrueBlot technology helps researchers produce high quality results with unparalleled clarity suitable for reproduction. Generate publication quality data with TrueBlot today. To learn more about TrueBlot, visit www.rockland-inc.com slash trueblot.